Hello, I'm the Bullmeister. Welcome back to Dragon Quest. Last time, we fought the dragon a couple times. I leveled up to 14 in between episodes. I finally got the magic armor. Spelled with a U, I just now noticed. <laughs> British spelling. Um, just a broad short, got an iron shield. Spells, I mean, in-house in spells, I have heal, glow, evac, and zoom. So if I get off the track, let's try this again. Play four times a charm against the green dragon. 22. There we go. I think we got it this time. Oh, maybe not. Okay, think one more heal. Hi, baby. Why are you smelling my toes? Why are you smelling my toes? Got it! Haha! -ha. Finally! Down you go! Ha ha ha! 950 experience points, that almost gets us a level up. And 250 gold coins. And we get ourselves a princess. At long last, one has come who will deliver me from my plight. Brave hero, I am Goylan, Princess of Tantigil. Hadst, hadst thou tarried a moment longer, the Dragon Lord would surely have made me, me his bride. Merely to imagine such an unspeakable fate striketh the dread into my dainty heart. <laughs> Mighty Bowmeister, thou wilt of course escort me to my home, the palace. Bowdry takes the princess in his big, strong arms. Why, Bowdry? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, folks. Okay. I messed with my mic settings in between episodes as well because I did my uh, channel update for June. So I should... Can I teleport with her in my arms? I can. And then... Oops. Wrong screen. And then... Zoom back to the fortress. In the fortress. I, is it? Can it truly be, Princess Goylin? Highness, and thou art uns, thou art unscathed. Verily, tis like unto a dream. Make haste unto the throne room, babe, bo, brave Bodry. The king must know of this. But I would not give to see the look upon his Majesty's face when he learneth of his daughter's miraculous preservation. Yeah, uh, it's just gonna be pixelated. Just saying. Brave Bodry. Thou hast delivered my only child from evil. Words cannot express my gratitude. Come now, Gwailin, return thee to thy rightful place at my side. I shall, father, but first I must give Bo brave Bodry a token of my undying appreciation. What the hell is Simper? How is that a... What is that a, an emote of? How, how do you emote Simper? I kind of looked that up at some point. Probably when I record this. <sighs> or probably when I edit this, I will put Simper somewhere on the screen. Brave Brodry, verily and truly, from the very bottom of my heart, I do love thee. Pray accept this modest symbol of my affection, humble though it may be. Though we better be far apart, ever shall I be at thy side. Now, brave Brodry, go forth upon thy quest. Brave Brodry, sensing my, sensing my anguish, thus did deliver my beloved daughter from her plight and return her safe, safely unto me. I shall not forget this great gift, nor shall I forget the man who gave it. But to business. Save. Yes. We got the princess's pledge. Gift from your beloved princess, Gwailin. Okay, let's see if I still have that up. Because uh, I need to... More or less need to know where I'm going next. Now that I have the princess's pledge. Oh. There is something we still have to do here. Good thing we still have a bunch of magic keys. I probably could have 
been able to do this earlier. Thou art Bodri, art thou not? Praise be, ever have I known that the one descendant of the mighty Edric was one day visit me here. The stout chest doth hout the holy sunstone entrusted unto my care by thy most heroic ancestor. It is needed in thy quest to save the dragon lord. To slay the dragon lord, is it not? Then take it, claim thy birthright. And we shall, we get the sunstone. Sounds, <laughs> to me that sounds like the mini metal tone from uh, Dragon Quest XI. That will bring light unto our realm once more, of that I have no doubt. But long now have I kept my vigil here. I grow tired. Soon I must take my rest at last. Are you just going to go to bed or are you going to die? I don't know. We're in bed. Even now I do well recall the face of my dear Erdrick, who did entrust the stunstone upon unto me. Thou art the very spit of thy storied forebearer. I beg of thee, brave Baudry, bring peace unto our realm once more. Oh man, I can't carry to see it in life. Well, what do I got? Turn. <laughs> I don't have anything I want to get rid of. Hang on, let's try using the princess's pledge. Okay. That really necessarily didn't do anything. Uh, we're gonna deposit. Uh oh. Something's not working right. Still recording? Still recording. Alright, I think this is gonna end up getting chopped up until I no more. Sorry about that. Uh, be back in a minute. Okay, I'm back. I had a hiccup. Hopefully that's not an indication of things to come. Uh, as I was trying to rearrange some chords, I accidentally knocked my microphone off my desk. So hopefully that's not an indication of things to come. I hope. If, if it is, I'm going to have to replace yet another microphone. And I need to probably just put it on a freaking boom arm so I can not drop another one. So anyway, we're going to drop the holy water. Because I want... I can always go in between episodes and pick up uh, magic keys. That's not a big deal. Nope, nope. I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way around. I also should... Oh, no. I should probably heal up for magic's sake, just so I have the magic. Because first things first... Oops. Because we'll go ahead and use that seed of life. And I'll grab the medicinal herb. We'll just go. We'll go ahead and use it. Just because I'm not worried about health at the moment. I'm actually more worried about magic than I am health. To be honest with you. And I believe you can heal us. Completely restored. Okay. Did I start my timer again? I did. Okay. I just want to make sure the timer ended up starting. That was strange that... Because what, what my microphone essentially did is that it's got an audio... Um, got audio capability, so I can plug it... I can plug my headphones into the microphone and go from there. What ended up happening is that it switched from the 
audio output switched from my headphones to the microphone. And so I had micro or I had mic in my ears, but no or you know, eventually mic came back after a brief audio hiccup. Okay. So now, do I still have magic keys? I've got two. Okay. Okay, sorry. Uh, as of this recording date, Pokemon Sword and Shield is getting its last main update for the first of the two DLC drops, the Isle of Armor. Yeah, it's the Isle of Armor. And that drops on the 17th of June. By the time this video comes out, just the end of July, it's already out. All right, so there's a specific part of the wall I need to press upon. Somewhere. There it is. Know that no man hath ventured into the grave of Galen and returned. Enter it only if thou carest not th for thy young life. And poof, he went. So now we're in here. I want glow. We'll see just how big of a maze. And I think I might be just a little bit over leveled for the area at the moment, but considering considering what I had to do in the area to get here, you know, I'll take being over leveled any day. In fact, I should get a level up here very soon. And so far, no new enemies to seek to speak of. We got three treasure chests, a seed of life, which I will gladly use. Oops. Treasure chest, 536 gold coins, nice. And a magic key. I'll gladly take the, any magic keys I can find. I dare say I'll have a need for them. By the way, the, Isle, the magic armor that I'm wearing restores HP while you walk. It's about every two or three steps I get one H or one point of HP recovered. Okay. Well, that looks important, but first and foremost, we're going to cast Glow so we can see where we're going. That's the end of the room, so we'll go down. We've got two stairs to go. And all sorts of stairs to go. Still no level up yet, but we haven't really come across an enemy that has... Like, been a real boon to our, uh... Our pool of experience. I mean, I'm getting plenty of gold, which at this point, I don't... Maybe I should have kept the holy water. <laughs> can I go? Yes, yeah, so can I go in the middle? I don't know what I'll find in here, but... Let's go down the stairs here. Let's see what's down here. Probably just another dead end. Well, that was good to learn. Oh no, my spell are off. I need to reglow.
Now, even like the bear werewolves are taking one shot, so. All right, I guess I'm gonna start taking stairs. So we'll start over here in this corner since it's closest. Oh, that's a new one. Now they're starting to get harder. This is a spike geist that took two hits. Still, I've been one-shotting everybody else, so. A droll diabolist. Okay, so the enemies are starting to get harder down here. I will gladly take the challenge. Trash just here. I got some gold. Victory for us again. Okay, cool. A scare wolf. He's probably gonna. Oh, never mind. I was gonna say he's gonna hit like a tank, but no. I don't know if this is... Okay, I just passed by an opening. Hey, there's a level up! Nice! Level 15, strength by 8, agility by 9. Resilience by 5, HP by 7, so we're almost close to 100. MP increased by 1, we learn Holy Protection and get 80 gold. Oh, well, Holy Protection is a... Nope. Nothing happens. Okay, let's go up these stairs. And recast glow. I think it's led me down here. Yeah, that led me down there. Yeah, that definitely took. That. I want to get in there, but how do I get in there? How do I get in it? Near you over there. All I gotta do is heal, or all I do is... Oh, it's a raving lunatic. All I gotta do is walk around and I can heal, so. But the raving lunatic goes down in one hit, of course. Okay. Can't say I'm not getting enough gold out of this. That is a dead end. You're gonna hear people above me as they're walking around. Oh, Skeleton Soldier, I think he's new. Ooh, he hit hard. But we're just gonna hit him right back with a critical hit. 72 and 20. Figure since I'm down here, I finish up the maze. Okay. Oh no! Glow again. Because. Maybe. If I go this way. And then go down the set of stairs that's right there. My big worry right now is losing what essentially is half the gold I collected. That is a dead end. Okay, good to know. I took these stairs already. Right, yeah. It only weren't so dark in here. Okay. No, maybe. I think this is a dead end too, but you never know. Nope, nope. And if all else fails, I can always 
I guess I can always just evac. Yeah, I think that was another dead end. How do I get in there? Is there another staircase I need to go into? Let's say take this staircase. Alright. Now we're getting somewhere. I hope. Next, I hope we're getting somewhere. There we are. Treasure chest, we got the Lyre of Ire. Well, luck. Okay. Anything else in here worth note? Nope. All right, we're out of here. So next time, we need to take the Liar Ire to the person who wanted to see the Liar of Ire. I can't remember if he's south or not. Yeah, hey, let's let's see what the Princess's Pledge has to say. Okay, that does absolutely nothing. <laughs> Except tell us where the castle is from our position and other things. Okay, but that's going to be it. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like and comment on this video. Drop a subscribe to the channel. Try to get to 100 subs so I can get a custom URL, I think. I think it's 100 that I get uh, so I can actually claim Lord Bowmeister or Bowmeister, however I can do it, as a channel. Um, as a channel name. Like, you can go to, like, youtube.com slash Lord Bowmeister, whatever. Don't actually do that, because I don't know if anyone actually exists with that name. Anyway, but that's it. Oh, and don't forget to ring the notifi notifi notification bell when videos go live daily, bi-daily, tri-daily, etc. And until then, I am the Bowmeister, and as always, I have been obediently yours.